try to make this video as short as I can. Uh, first off, um, I'm asking for anybody's help, but I know Jose, uh, RC Jose, um, has been uh, my biggest help online so far. Real quick, all right, here we go. I originally bought the uh, Creus All-in-One Pro controller board here, and I was unable to upload anything to it uh, through my Arduino um, program. Um, it would time out. It would give me a timeout error. Uh, it would have a little flashing light like that one's doing now, but it would time out. It wouldn't ever give me a steady bunch of flashes or whatever. I got tired of looking it up and trying to find how to fix it, so I just discarded it and bought the multi Wii, which is supposed to be the same board overall, um, except it's you know it's a Hobby King, it's maybe a Hobby King, uh, electronics, whatever. Either way, um, so. I took everything, my original GPS and everything that I had with the, my Creus, and it, everything hooked up fine. Uh, even my my connections on my um, copter that I had running, I had uh, two running from here and two running from here to power my GPS. Well, since then, and uh, I've had a crash and I've replaced some things, but obviously my GPS broke the antenna, well, it broke off, and then the connection the antenna so I just went ahead and bought another one that's a four pin it's a four pin the new one I have is a six pin now I'm thinking that from what my research is it should go in here because the not that one I'm sorry the other uh, yeah this one here because it's got the the RXO TXO um, wires, even though they're backwards off of here, a little different. Uh, so I'll have to probably solder it, resolder it. So either way, okay. So you see what you see is connected. Uh, I've got the com port, com port chosen. Everything's right. The right boards. It uses the same board as the um, the Mega. Um, so I got that selected. Got no issues with that. Um, and I'm not going through every single thing I went through. Um, I know some people use the USB BAP. I use the um, ISP here. Had had any issues? Um, don't have any issues reading it from Mission Planner either. Um, whether I make changes to this or not, uh, all in one, or if I if I make it the the Pro, it doesn't matter. Even if I make it the Pro. It'll still compile, uh, or won't compile. I'm sorry. So, um, but supposedly I'm I'm supposedly be able I'm able to run it as a Creus all in one. So let's go ahead and change that Creus. All right. So we'll just copy this. I'll copy that. Highlight it. Hit copy. And then I'll go back to. Here and paste. There. Okay. That should take care of that. All right. Then the the board config is set up as uh, BP085 Pirate. I don't know what it should be fit that. I've never messed with that. So. Um, so that, that really shouldn't have a because the only thing that's changed is the actual GPS. Okay, uh, let's see. GPS on this, I've got none. I had changed it when I originally installed my original U blocks. I changed it to U blocks, which should technically still be on the board because once I crashed it, I didn't wipe it out. It just it showed the mission planner that I didn't have a Jeep. GPS, so so I'll type in U blocks here. U blocks. Uh, yeah, and that should be U blocks right there. Okay. And I'll fly it as a quad, of course. Quad frame, X configuration, all that's right. Um, it's channel seven definition. Um, 
all that stuff. I don't know what that means, but that's fine. But here it is, same way I did it originally. Now I'm going to compile it, and this is under my H file. And I went back and opened my H file in uh, under my. Um, now this is uh, Arduino uh, Zero Five, which is the newest version. I've tried it on uh, Zero. As a matter of fact, you can see over here. I've got Zero downloaded in this one particular file, but I also got. But I also got the. Uh, I've got it installed. Um, uh, quad build files. I got a Creus right here. I've tried to use uh, Ardu Arduino 1.1, 1.3. I've used Mega Pirate 2.8. Uh, Multi Wii worked on the Creus. Uh, uh, I've used uh, Mega Pirate 2.7, 2.8.3. I've used, I've tried everything I can think of. But I've installed this in a totally different file by itself. So it won't have any issues. So now let me load the Arduino up. And I'm going to. Alright, whether I hit the, the check button or not, it's still going to give me a problem. But I'm going to hit the check. Alright, there it goes. No max function for call AP. Um, the alt hold problem and that didn't change it's not loading and I'll do it again with just the upload see what happens same thing all right I'm gonna go back I'm gonna close this out and I'm gonna upload one of my old Arduinos um, um, 1.03 here. I'll upload this one. Oh yes, I'm running it as administrator also, which I figured might. Alright, take care of any conflicts. Alright. Okay, then I'll open, hit open, open, and I'll make sure I'm going to a different version. Uh, I don't want that one, I want to use one of my older versions of. Create this all in one program. Alright, use this one. Okay. And I'm going to use the. Yeah, there we go. So I got it saved inside. Also got the files, the library files in there. Alright. So select the file that I have here. I guess I can check the H. Oh, I usually do the PD, PDE, but the H. From what you're saying, uh, Jose. Let me check my. So all one, there you go, all one pro. Okay. Okay, there we go. Range, sonar, protocol, G. Okay, no, that's not it. GPS. Okay, U box. This is the one I was using before. Alright, so now I'll hit compile or hit check. And it gives me another one. No problem. Now this is from my H file. Let me try to upload it. You can see the blinking light. It blinked for a second. And there's an error. Okay. Open. I 
Okay, instead of using the H file, I'll use the PDPE. PDE, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm just going to check it. I'm not even going to upload it. I'm just going to check it real quick. Okay, and there you go. Same thing. Just for me checking it. Alright. Go to open. Alright, I'm going to another. I'll do another. Right. Go to. That was Mega Pirate. Alright, go straight to Mega Pirate. 2.8 there. Autocopter, autocopter. Here's an H file. Okay. Alright, let me check this one. Same thing. I'm gonna go try seven real quick. And the thing is, is I've I've, I've changed all the library files over. And I know this particular one only goes with one of those. Um, let, let's see. But I've wiped it all out and I've started over. And uh, each time, even even with all those, I've, that's why I started that new file. I made sure it was directed to that file because um, it's still causing the, the, the upload issue. All right, so open. Let's go to, so real quick, I'm, I'm let's see. Let's go back to this for sake of argument. <coughs> okay, I use the multi wii My little folder I made for multi wii I got two Arduinos. I got the old 1.0 version, and see, I got 2.83. 2.8. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use the, the newest Arduino, and then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the library folder out of here, libraries, copy, and I'm gonna put it in the Arduino. Alright, of course, and yes. Do this for all conflicts. Yes. Okay. Copy and replace. Okay. Let's see what this lives for. Alright, so everything should be inside. Coming from that Ardomino there. Ardocopter. Ardocopter. Alright, so. Make sure I close this one here out. Okay. Now I'm going to open this one. I'm just going to run it this time as administrator. I've done both, but. Preferences, make sure it's pointed in the right directory. Mega Pirate, and it's pointed here. That's not going to matter. Okay, okay. It's not going to matter because I'm going to go to it, I guess. Let's see. Sketchbook. Now open. Now I'm going to make sure I'm at the right location. Okay, I'm not. Right now I'm not. I'm about to be. Okay. multi multi -TV. Okay. I use this autocopter, so I'm going to use that one to pull my... GPS. It's got none. I'll have one hooked up to it right now. But for the sake, I will go ahead and change it to E blocks. E blocks. 
So that's the only thing I was trying to change anyway. Alright. Frame, X type frame. Alright, so let me do a verify. Error compiling. See, I get one of those two um, errors. I get a compiling error or I get the alt hold error. Depending on, I guess, which version I'm using. Um, so, and then, just for the sake of doing it, I'll try to upload it. Alright, I'm hitting up. Well, let's real quick make sure I got the right programmer, right board, which I do. Serial port 4, which it is. Okay, so all that's correct. So, I'm going to hit upload. I'm hitting that right. Now, see that little flash tick? But that's it. It's not doing anything else. It's gotten a little steadier. There you go. Error compiling. Alright, that's with me using the H. So, cancel. So, let's do this. Just for argument's sake. Let's go to this one. I'm not going to make any changes. I'm just checking it. It should be right. I mean, something it shouldn't be wrong. As long as I'm not uploading it, it should be compatible. I can check with it. And it shows it's 2.8 R3 error compiling. Alright, with that being said, real quick, while I'm still videoing it, we're going this far. Let's um, pull up Mission Planner. This I have no problems with. Oh yeah, I haven't asked about how to hook this Bluetooth up either. This is a I don't know how to hook this up with my current board. So, all right, here is Com Four, just like before. Connect it. See all this happening, which is right. Now, my Creus won't connect to Mission Planner. It'll connect to um, uh, MultiWii or the other one, but it won't connect to Mission Planner. Alright, and see this. See, so the GPS, which I mean, I don't have a GPS connected, but even if I connect GPS, it won't show it. And I don't know if I'm connecting it right. I know I had my U-Blocks connected right, this one, but uh don't know about this one. So, I mean, if I can even upload or change the parameters here, I don't know where to do it, though. Firmware or whatever, so I don't know where to do it. Configuration there. So, either way. Alright, I'm going to upload this to the internet real quick and hopefully somebody can give me some help and see what I can do.